Hey everybody, I'm here on Jordan's birthday. Uh, we're gonna do a little house tour because Jordan's obviously the, the designer of most of the things that have happened and Jordan and her mom are actually the people that did most of what you'll see. Um, additionally, even if you had been here recently, I promise there's things that are different. Here we go. All right, so here's the entrance. When you walk in, it opens up pretty wide. Originally the design called for this wall to go out and then that became like a hallway down there, but we decided to open that up. The first room on the left is the upstairs office. Jordan's been growing these plants up here for a while. They are real plants, which I didn't know was possible, but they're killing it. More real plants. So this is Jordan's current workspace, so she can get some natural light in her life. On the opposite side is the dining room with a guest appearance by Quincy, who's keeping watch. Okay, next up over here, we have a half bath. And a finished coat closet. It's not really being used for much, but it looks really nice. Over here we have uh, the birthday girl herself enjoying some lovely intellectual television. On the side of the TVs, you guys can see these built-in shelves. So that was um, Jordan's idea. They look pretty good. Uh, we did not do those in ourselves. That was a professional that reached our limit. Anyway, here's the great room. And on next to that uh, is the kitchen. So here we have the kitchen uh, with an island and a breakfast room adjacent to it. And a cool sized pantry, which actually Jordan just reorganized the other day. We got uh, the backyard. So that includes the half court basketball court. That was a must. And this patio with the pergola and a fire pit. We don't have all the stuff out correctly because it's been too cold, but you get the idea. All right, and next up we'll go to the basement. Oh, actually, and here's the butler's pantry and the mudroom. The mudroom is next. I don't know if you heard Jordan say that, but her mom's coming to paint it soon, even though the little guy's on the way. So Jordan won't be allowed around the paint, but. All right, here's on the way down. Jordan's grandpa actually cut uh, this piece of wood with a chainsaw um, and like stained it and finished it and came and installed it himself. Oh yeah, and this is a, uh, this wall was done by Jordan and her mom. Can't ship lap. All right, so here's the basement. We got a movie theater starting to get equipped with baby stuff. This is also the lair where all the uh, bear cat stuff is. The lair is the name of the student section. This isn't what I was expecting my man cave to look like, but I'll take what I can get. We got some Cincinnati stuff all over the place. All right, we have a full bath down here. Another, there's since. Cincinnati important locations. Jordan made me that for my birthday once. We have a kitchenette. It has pretty much everything but an oven and a dishwasher, a range. My favorite part of the whole basement's on the upper left. 
You see dartboard with a really fancy painter's tape line to show you the correct distance. All right, and this is what I'm, I'm, I'm dubbing the arena. So this is the future arena right here. Boom, this is where all the sports are gonna be played. And I told Jordan all these pictures over here are gonna get broken, so just be ready for that. We'll see what happens. But I imagine a mini basketball hoop, boom, right there. It's gonna be awesome. Um, and the rest of the basement is office number two. So Jordan's business, most of uh, the packing and shipping and cutting and pasting and gluing and all that crazy stuff happens down here. All right, and let's go up. So this is a uh, board and batten all around the staircase. The guy who did the built-in shelves around the TV in the great room did that too. And this chair rail that you see, pretty cool stuff. All right, I'll start off down here in the guest room. This is the uh, guest room because it has its own bathroom. The other one is a Jack and Jill, so we're gonna make that the kids' rooms. So up here we just have a bed, dresser, wall-mounted TV, and attached bathroom. This is kind of the catch-all room right now, so ignore the mess, but this is other kid bedroom at some point, if we have another kid. Right now, it's a good perch for Quincy and Pumbaa. Here. They like to come up here and bark at every single thing in the entire neighborhood, but it's cute. Here's the Jack and Jill part, the attached bathroom. It has two vanities, which we think is nice and it has the separate shower. So if one of them takes 30 minutes in the shower, the other one can still use the, the sink and stuff, get ready for their day. And here is the nursery. So this has been a lot of work by all parties. Uh, Jordan's done most of the finishing touches. All the stuff you see hanging, she actually made a bunch of stuff, which is cool. Like she made all those pom-poms she just bought a little tool. She made these flags. You'll see a couple of them. She made this Go Bearcats thing, which is sweet. She made this thing too. So we got a dresser, mirror, cool flag thing. Obviously we got the crib, the lounge chair. And we got a pretty good start on this kid's clothes and diapers and bath stuff and everything it feels like, but I'm sure this is nothing compared to what he'll have in a couple years. All right. Um, couple more things. One is the upstairs laundry. So this was Jordan's vision as well. Her and her mom did these. These are actually just like stickers. These tile things back here. Um, I want the farmhouse copper sink. Some floating shelves. And here's the master, which we just redid. And we have some board and batten along the back there. We have these two by fours because we're putting a uh, fake fireplace in over here. We're gonna build this wall out a tiny bit. Uh, Bennett's bassinet over here, the snoo. Hopefully it works the wonders it's supposed to. Over here we got the dresser TV. You can see our bags. We got our hospital bags ready to go 
Jordan's at 37 weeks and one day of filming and she'll be, I think at 38 weeks and four days when you guys watch this. Here's the bathroom, we got a little nook there. Double vanity, a not working right now. Shower, we're having some drain issues. Water closet, and here's one of the reasons we got the place. We got a pretty huge master closet, which as you can see is still very full. Very full. All right, I hope you guys had a good time looking at the crib, but uh, it's time for you to go. Happy birthday, Jordan. <laughs>